Mrs. Victor Laszlo. But why my name, Richard? Because you're getting on that plane. I don't understand. What about you? I'm staying here with him till the plane gets safely away. No, Richard, no. What has happened to you last night? Last night we said a great many things. You said I was to do things for the both of us. Well, I've done a lot of it since then. It all adds up to one thing. You're getting on that plane with Victor where you belong. But Richard, no. You've I... got to listen to me. Do you have any idea what you'd have to look forward to if you stayed here? Nine chances out of ten, we'd both end up in a concentration camp. Isn't that true, Lewis? I'm afraid Major Strausser would insist. You're only saying this to make me go. I'm saying it because it's true. Inside of us, we both know you belong with Victor. You're part of his work, the thing that keeps him going. If that plane leaves the ground and you're not with him, you'll regret it. No! Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but soon, and for the rest of your life. But what about us? We'll always have Paris. We didn't have... We'd lost it until you came back to Casablanca. You got it back last night. And I said I would never leave you. And you never will. But I've got a job to do too. Where I'm going, you can't follow. What I've got to do, you can't be any part of. Elsa, I'm no good at being a noble, but it doesn't take much to see that problems of three little people don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. Someday you'll understand that. <laughs> now, now. Here's looking at you, kid. <laughs> <laughs>